Hi all, it's David here from DP Computing. Today we've got a Toshiba Satellite A350. I'm just going to do a basic teardown to show you how to get to the memory, hard drive and so forth. Anyway, before we start, just a word of warning, please proceed at your own risk. If you see anything different, please um, seek a professional. And anything you do is uh, we take no responsibility, okay? First thing, is to remove the power which is up here to make sure that's disconnected and the battery the battery is here to remove the battery there's two little tabs they have to be slid outwards to this one will stay in place this one you'll have to hold with your finger and then there's a little finger hole there you can just pull out the battery and there's the battery so if you can read that if not it's a model number PA 3534U-1BAS and it's a DC 10.8 volt 4000 milliamps there we go now the battery is, is behind, no the battery, the memory is behind this panel here so it's just got the one screw it's just a Phillips head screw and I'm using a number one um, bit on my screwdriver so here we've got the memory this one's got two dims in and to remove them there's two on this one they're black if you push the little black uh, tabs outwards the memory will pop up and then you can slide it out and then to put it back in just make sure the little hole lines up with the divider there in the slot push it in and push it down over here we've got the Wi-Fi module um, wireless card so that's held in by two screws there so again they're just Phillips head screws so you can remove them and it'll pull out now we've got another screw here which I believe is for the optical drive so just remove that screw and the optical drive pops out and there's the optical drive itself um, this one model number is GSA-T50N and this one's a multi DVD rewriter Let's put that to one side now we've got two bays here for the hard drives usually this bay is the number one hard drive and that's number two but it may vary depends on your BIOS setup now in this machine there's only actually one hard drive so once we open this you'll see there's no actual hard drive behind the scenes here underneath um, there's actually no connector either on this model so just double check if you want to put a hard drive in there now just before I'll just pop that back in just before I put the screws back in on that side just a word of warning um, the screws over here are short stubby and the ones over here for this hard drive are a bit longer so you've got the bit, bit longer ones there and the other ones whoops there we are so the shorter ones are for here the longer ones are for the other drive bay just so you don't mix them up so I'll just leave that to the side take out the other screw here And again, this just lifts up, and there we've got the hard drive. Uh, it's held in by those two screws we removed on the panel, and there's a little plastic tab here. Just pick that up and push, pull it outwards, and there you've got the hard drive in its little holder. To remove the holder, just there's four screws on the side. These are silver screws. Just remove those. and the hard drive itself will pop out so there's the hard drive so you can replace that by reversing what we just did you can put in an SSD or replace for a bigger hard drive or whatever so there you have it 
there's a very quick um, teardown on how to upgrade the the battery, the memory, the hard drives and the Wi-Fi module and also the optical drive and this is a Toshiba Satellite A350 so thank you for watching and please check out our YouTube channel thanks again I'll catch you next time bye for now